Five reasons empaths rarely cross paths. It is very difficult to meet another empath. Because empaths rarely encounter each other. Empaths tend to get involved with narcissists. Which is why there are so many channels on narcissistic abuse. One, narcissists pretend to be empaths. Empaths desire true love. And if they lose a loved one, they have difficulty finding another one. And the reason for that is because empaths care more about others than themselves. So they put other people's needs before their own. And even when they think they found someone who can give them the love and the attention that they're looking for. It ends up being a narcissist instead. Because narcissists pretend to be kind and compassionate. Two, empaths are rare. So it's unlikely that two empaths will cross paths. But if they do, they will get along very well. Empaths focus their attention on the people around them. They're not concerned about finding someone who can give them what they need. Because their main concern is helping other people. But even if they do try to find another empath, they may just run into a narcissist. And then they may assume that they're fine on their own. Or they may believe that there is no one else like them. Because empaths are very private. They don't like to share too much about themselves. Unless they feel comfortable. Three, empaths need someone who needs them. Empaths want to feel needed. And narcissists want someone who will give them what they need. So it is far more likely for an empath to meet a narcissist rather than another empath. Empaths are surrounded by people who need them rather than people who can give them what they need. So it is very rare that they will find another empath who can care for and protect them. Because without outside influence or intervention, empaths can sustain themselves. They don't need help in satisfying their basic needs. Or they may not be compatible. 
Empaths may not always be who you expect them to be. You may have an image of an empath in your mind, but that's not who they may be in person. Empaths may not be physically attracted to each other, as empaths typically aren't too concerned about their appearance. They may also not have a lot of money, as they invest everything they have into taking care of other people's needs, instead of worrying about their own. Five, empaths know that they are rare. They know that there aren't many people out there who are like them. Because throughout their lives, they have always been the one who is taking care of someone else. They may never have experienced someone who attends to their needs. So they may assume that they are the only one. And they may stop searching for other empaths. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button to receive the notifications. If you would like to support the channel, you can donate at paypal.me slash narcsurvivor. You can book a one-on-one -on -one with me on my website. It's narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.